Hi students, last class already we are discussing about heterocyclic compounds, non-aromatic and aromatic compounds. So first of all, aromatic means, aromatic means what? Aromatic means it should be follow alternative, alternative double bonds it should be ring or cyclic compound aromatic compounds means alternative double bonds is there and ring or cyclic compound and then planar structure planar structure and moreover Hund's rule Hund's uh, sorry Huckel's rule Huckel's rule should be followed what is Huckel's rule 4 n plus 2 pi electrons 4 n plus 2 pi electron it should be satisfied means it is heteros uh, aromatic compound that is aromatic means Next, uh, now we will discuss about open chain compound. Example also I will give open chain compounds. What is open chain? For example, non cyclic compounds are called aliphatic. Non cyclic means not a cycle. Non cyclic compound non cyclic compounds are called non cyclic compounds are called aliphatic compounds aliphatic aliphatic non cyclic compounds are called aliphatic compounds so and these compounds consist of uh, branched or unbranched chain example branched unbranched what is that branched ch3 ch3 this is ethane two carbons is there means it after i will explain about that it means what like uh, first this is uh, alicyclic compound means no cycle cyclic structure not this is only simple ethane next or open chain compound next ch3 ch2 ch3 this is one more compound next ch2 double bond ch2 this is also not a cyclic compound so this name is ethylene this name is propane so like these compounds are called open chain compounds in that open chain saturated is there and unsaturated also is there no saturated saturated compound means what formula cn h2n plus 2 this is saturated hydrocarbon formula instead of n you can take 2 what we will get c2 h to 2 zero 4 here also n is there this is 2 mean this is also 2 2 2 zero 4 plus 2 6 c2 h6 c2 h6 is a saturated compound how i will say saturated there is no double bond means that is a saturated compound no double bond example this one this one is no double bond see this is also that only structure c one hydrogen here one hydrogen here one more hydrogen here one bond again c c2 no one hydrogen here one hydrogen here one more hydrogen here so c2 h6 this is saturated hydrocarbon also this is name is eth a n e so saturated carbon to one type no saturated is one type that is alkene i said alkene i said so alk means carbon chain ane means 
ANE means single bond. So all single bond compounds are saturated carbon compounds. Saturated hydrocarbons otherwise. So this is a saturated. Saturation means single bond between the two carbon atoms. Okay, ma. So the formula is CNH2N plus 2. Okay. Now here one carbon we will call what? Meet A and E because saturated no A and E will come. Alkane. Alk instead of alk one carbon ah, carbon number one means meet will come. Two carbons is there C2. What we will say? Ethane. Ethane. Like three carbons is there C3. What we will call? Propane A and E. Why A and E? comes under saturated this all yes sir how one example 3 you can take take here 3 instead of n then c3 3 into 2 6 h6 plus again 2 h8 c3 h8 structural formula c carbon 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 3 carbons 8 hydrogens is there one hydrogen here one hydrogen here one hydrogen here and one more hydrogen here one more hydrogen here remaining three here so corner carbon atom contains a three three hydrogen six and year one year one eight hydrogens is there okay c3 h8 so this is the propane if carbons four is there carbon number four we will call butane if carbon number five c5 five, we will call Pent N. If carbon number 6, we will call X A and E, X N. Like we will naming, we will give naming for that, like this. This is about saturated. Now, unsaturated compounds also is there, no? That is the classification of alicyclic or open chain compounds unsaturated two types unsaturated is two types what is that one is all keen e n e formula c n h 2 n minus 2 hmm? minus 2 not a c n h 2 n only amma. this is a alkene example instead of a n you can take two c 2 2 into 2 h 4 C to H4 structural formula C double bond C here one hydrogen here one hydrogen here one hydrogen here one hydrogen carbon valency ma tetra valency tetra valency so carbon anywhere four bonds is there or not we will check so here also this carbon having four bonds this carbon also having four if this carbon in alkane this carbon also four okay so that is about uh, unsaturated carbon compounds alkenes means c double bond c alkene c single bond c alkane now alkyne formula cn h2n minus 2 so in this formula you can apply instead of this one 2 c2 h 2 into 2 4 4 minus 2 2 c2 h2 this is the alkyne how carbon valency 4 only two hydrogen is there for each carbon like this now between three bonds is there so that only okay uh, three bonds is there between so two carbons so this is uh, alkyne y n e so alkene double bond formula CnH2n alkyne formula CnH2n minus 2 saturated carbon alkene CnH2n plus 2 so this is here methane we are writing no ethane we are writing ethane two carbons means here also two carbons but we should write uh, ethane y n e not ethane E T H Y N E ethane. If alkane, what we should write? Two carbons means ethene. E N E we should write. Here Y N E, here E N E, 
here a and e like okay thank you next uh, cyclic or closed chain compounds also heterocyclic uh, last class heterocyclic compounds discussed now cyclic open chain compounds saturated unsaturated unsaturated discussed now homocyclic uh, is there heterocyclic completed homocyclic only is there homocyclic compounds we will discuss next class